Second day of digital learning. Today is Tuesday, March 24th, 2020. Today is a new day. There's new tasks, there's new assignments, there's new things to do. Let's dive right into it and talk about them. Arch Canada Research Project. We talked about this yesterday. You were tasked with sending me pictures of your completed Arctic Animal Research Project. Some of you did this, some of you not so much. Um, if you have not managed to pull that off, let's get that done today. Um, if you have that done, that's great. Let's talk about the essays. Some of us had the essays done before we went off uh, at the end of the school last week, week before last. Some of us not so much. Let's get everybody across that finish line. So your Arctic Animal essay needs to be five paragraphs, right? Introduction, physical characteristics, habitat and diet, interesting facts, conclusion. You might even be able to separate that... Uh, diet and habitat into two separate paragraphs make six paragraphs um your essay needs to be pretty lengthy you have all the research done you should have everything ready to go on that front let's get to work on writing it um if you are struggling with it send me an email about it send me an alert send me a notification somehow let me know that you're about to go working on it and i will be right there with you okay you saw a lot of you saw yesterday that when you sign on to your documents and you share those documents with me I get an alert and I sign on the document with you, kind of help guide you through things with some typing while you're there. So if you see my text come up, we can kind of work through these portions together. But we really want to get these essays squared off and done. Next thing that you've got for today is there's an area in perimeter video to watch the answer to the question I gave you yesterday. Remember that question I gave you? Some of you got it done, lickety split, nice and easy. Some of you struggled and that's okay. Today we're going to go through how to get it done. So I posted a video on area and perimeter. It is all about that question and how to get it done. It walks you through the entire process. I think the video is about 10 minutes long. If you are really confused, maybe watch the video more than once because there's an assignment that, come along, there's an assignment that comes along with it. That assignment is on Google Forms. It's a new thing we've never used. I posted it to Google Classroom. I understand when you sign on to it, it might be difficult, might be easy, might be able to figure it out. These things are typically fairly user-friendly. So I think you'll be able to figure it out. If you find some difficulty, again, send me an email. I'll try to be as responsive to those as possible. Let's see. Um, don't forget, hey, you've got a typing.com account. We're spending a lot of time using computers. There's a lot of typing occurring. I might practice some of those typing skills on typing.com. Yesterday you had a prodigy assignment. Some of us finished, some of us didn't. You have today to finish that assignment. You get two days for these assignments. Uh, and speaking of two days, now you've got your second day of the article a day on extra, nope, uh, article a day on ReadWorks. So ReadWorks has got an article a day assignment up there. Uh, every day there's a new article. Today I'd like you to square off another article. That means you're going to read a different article. You're going to respond. Hey, in those responses, can you try to make sure that you're writing in complete sentences? And speaking of complete sentences, emails. Emails. When you send me an email, I want you to send me the email. Okay, if your parents have a question, then they should send me an email. But I want every one of us to be familiar with how to use our email. Okay, the Gmail account, you, your first name, underscore, last name, at students.nksd.net. I need you to be able to use that. We don't know when we're going back to school. We don't know how long we're going to need to be savvy with this tech stuff. So let's really dive into it and really master some of those um, ins and outs, some of those little things like email. When you send an email, email should also be in complete sentences. That's important. Spelling, punctuation, grammar, all those things. You need to always do those. If it's really bad, I might not even answer your questions until you correct that grammar. Don't be lazy. Let's see. Oh, Pecos Bill. Hey, tall tales. Pecos Bill. 
I told you we were going to read about him. He's one of my favorite Telltale characters to read about. That guy rides tornadoes. He's crazy. Uh, there is a Pecos Bill PDF for you to read. Um, it's a link listed on Google Classroom. Follow the link to the page. The page will bring you to an article. The article is information about Pecos Bill. It's a StoryWorks article. It's a Scholastic article. If you have difficulty doing it, you can make a comment right there in Google Classroom. You can also send me an email, and we'll look at it that way, okay? If you're struggling getting any of this tech stuff done, let me know. We'll see what we can't do to fix it. All right. Um, it is a short version of Pecos Bill. It's an abridged uh, version. Abridged. That's a fun word. It's your word of the day is abridged. Open up that document. Add abridged to it. Yesterday you had boohoo. Today you have abridged. Let's get the part of speech, the definition, and use it in a sentence. What you're going to be reading today is an abridged version of Pecos Bill. Let's take the time to make sure that actually gets done. Extra math every day. Get right on there. Get those scores in there. Read for 20 minutes at home. That's super important. Make sure you get that done. You've got rump. There's a new chapter that is going to either be posted soon or is already posted. Look out for that one. Uh, new chapter. Chapter 21. Rump. Yesterday was our first day. Today is our second day. We've got a lot on our plate. We've got a lot to get done. You've got all day to do it. Take your time. Get some help from your parents. Send me some emails. Don't stress yourselves out. All right? You guys have got this. You're a great group. I was super excited to see all the Arctic Animal pictures that I saw yesterday. I can't wait to share them with you. You're going to love what everybody did. You guys are awesome. Have a great day. Work hard. Do your best. I'll see you again tomorrow morning, all right?